Hey guys, what is up? Now, today I'm going to be doing a review of sorts for the Ray-Ban Aviator. A friend gave me these as a trade. Really cool. And I've come to sort of kind of like, you know, these sunglasses. They're alright. So it comes in this fake leather-like, it actually feels real, this leather-like material, like a cowhide. has the Ray-Ban logo really neat and it's like this button so you open it up you have your sunglasses inside pull out the aviators and there you go these are some really hot looking head headphones so used to doing headphone reviews this is a really good sunglasses and it's really high quality metal got the Ray-Ban logo over here really decent lenses now these don't do Oakley protection when it comes to so, comes to the sun, you know. But these do really good. They're really stylish, and it's a very high quality earpiece. I don't know what color it is, but it feels nice. It has clear plastic for the nose piece. Like I said, metal bands all the way through. Uh, it has some text: Aviator, large metal. Let's say over here. Made in Italy. Alright, so the Ray Bans are made in Italy. I did not know that. This is actually my first Ray Ban sunglasses ever. I wasn't really preferring them, but I did want the aviator, so I did take that offer. So when I put them on, I think it's just me since I have a really deformed head or something, but the sunglasses feel weird. They don't fit correctly, the ear pieces, the whole thing. It's kind of off a little bit, so, I mean, the fit wasn't all that great, but it does line up pretty nicely. It looks really, really awesome. So, I think this is a good sunglasses. Now, I don't really know how much these go for. I imagine the $200 range. Would I pay that much? Me, personally, no. I'd rather pay the $200 for Oakley's, but that's just me. I think these are really, really good looking sunglasses. Anybody can rock these high quality aviator sunglasses so that's just my quick review of the Ray-Ban large aviator sunglasses I'll take care